thought you were going to be a real one. But you belong out there in the streets. You're a real enemy on the streets. Ooh. What's good, y'all? Should put up with you back at another video, man. Yes, we're back with another reaction. Yes, I'm in the same fit, same video. What's good, y'all? Should put up with you back at another video. Yes, I'm in the same fit as the last video. Two videos in one day because I'm a grinder, man. Stop playing with me, okay? Look, we got another reaction for y'all today. That's a little long, but it don't matter because you don't have nothing to do. You sitting at home doing nothing, so you might as well just watch the whole thing, watch all the ads, and make me some money. So I can go back to Miami because I don't like being here. Okay, okay, all right. Let's get to it, man. Girlfriend heartlessly dumps and humiliates boyfriend. Emotional. Okay. Let's see how emotional it is, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn the notification bell, share, do everything that you need to do. You feel me? Do it. You already here. Just like the video. Just like it. That's all, that's all I'm asking. Let's get into it. Okay, first things first, loyalty test. What is the point of a loyalty test? Bruh, if I feel like I can't trust you, just leave. You doing all this embarrassing yourself online. If you if you feel like she's gonna cheat on you, leave. All that extraness. You need me to watch in real time whether she accepts her declines going on with David Jordan. I'm like, but we're gonna laugh at you, so thanks. Yeah. She probably cheating on you because you decided to wear that shirt today, boy. I'm on you. So, man, I hope so. I really, really hope so. Hopefully, she is. You know, I'm really praying for like, you know, I'm saying nothing worse. So, like, yeah. I feel it. Bro, if you put me on, if you, if you feel like you guys put me on a loyalty test, just leave me, please, just leave me. You caught Vanessa on Tinder on her phone, so she has Tinder on her phone, and you guys are in a relationship. Yeah, and I don't get it. Like, I don't know, man. Like, you, you talked to her about like having Tinder on her phone, and you asked her like, yo, what is this? Like, I asked her about it. She said like, oh, I just forgot to delete. Like, but we've been dating for a while. How can you forget? And not just any type of game. It's when you meet people. You right. Really, like, if y'all. I ain't gonna lie, my girl, she seen that I had Tinder on my phone and she got mad. But, in my defense, I only had Tinder on my phone because I did a YouTube video way, way back and I just forgot to delete it. I did. It's just, I deleted it. You feel me? It never came back on my phone. You feel me? I did it, but it was for YouTube purposes. That video did good too, but I had to take it down because I left my phone number in it. But, that's neither here nor there. She knows that you don't have it and she still has it. So we hired our friend Jordan to help us with this test. See, Jordan is a jack of all trades, and he's recently begun creating art and selling it for thousands of dollars. Despite being pretty successful as is, though, he look like me. Jack up his net worth a little if you squint your eyes and tilt your, twi twi your head a little bit. Multi million dollar home, and will also be pretending to be a poker champion. See, it's going to be Gabriel's job to bring Vanessa to Jordan's supposed help. Vanessa will think that she's simply coming over to hang up with the boys. However, in reality, Gabriel is bringing her here so that Jordan could make a move on her and. I'm sorry, but that shirt is horrible, dude. <laughs> that shirt is horrible. Behind to finish setting everything up. Once everything was in place, we then all got into our positions. So, we are going to be moving with this car right over there on the side street right there because that's where we're going to be hiding. And this is where Gabriel's going to meet us when he makes up his excuse to leave. This is where Gabriel's going to be able to watch and listen in as Jordan asks Vanessa on a date. So, we 
were also going to be using this test to find out if Vanessa was still actively using Tinder. Yeah, it's a little sus that she has the app on her phone, but she may have just forgotten to delete it. In order to get to the truth, though, we have Gabriel re-download Tinder, walk back onto his profile, and sent us a screenshot of his messages with Vanessa. We then took that screenshot, photoshopped it a bit, and made it seem as if Jordan also matched and messaged Vanessa. Now, unfortunately for Jordan, though, we made it seem as if Vanessa left him on red. You guys will see how this all ties in later, but Jordan's basically going to use this photoshopped image to see if Vanessa is still actively using Tinder. Downstairs right now, presumably to go open the door. My dog, what up, bro? That's a nice house, man. Okay, guys, yes, this is them. Gabriel has successfully brought Vanessa over. Hey, how many years have you been talking Dude, honestly, I don't even know. Life's been going so fast. Like, Show her face! Show her face! Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I just came in here, actually. Like, yeah, he told me that like, he, he did it, like, he said it was his art in there. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, art blessed me. You brought your girl to the rich friend's house and you thought that she wasn't going to choose up? Especially if you ain't got no money? Do y'all not understand what women is out here doing for money? And you brought her to your... You should have checked your relationship, bro. Because she gone. She gone. 50k is a lot, but people are selling million dollar pieces. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Like, last month, I made $400,000 in art. $400,000? $400,000. Yeah, look at your guys. Pretty soon here. Gabriel's gonna be making up his excuse to leave and come join me here. I mean, how do y'all meet? Like, what's y'all's y'all situation, you know? Uh, I think we were dating. Uh, That's your problem. We met through Tinder. Tinder is not for good people. <laughs> Tinder is not for good people. I'm telling you right now, bro. I'm telling you, I did a whole YouTube video on it. They're not for good people. Tinder, let's go, hey. Tinder's amazing. What are you doing this weekend, bro? Can I open it? Yeah, we're playing some cards, you already know. Cards? What kind of cards? Oh, poker. I've never played poker. You've never played poker? Never. It's okay, we'll teach you. You know how to play? I feel like we should have cocktails right now, but let me pull a postmate. We can just order like something. Yeah, it's okay. We're, yeah, it's okay, bro. Let me like just pull up. You want like a cocktail or what? What you like? What do you want me to pour? Like, I'll just order. You know what I'm thinking? I can order it. You know, while you you help you help with the poker. You feel me? Cause she doesn't she doesn't know it. Okay, perfect. Gabriel is making up his excuse to exit the scene and come join me here. Pick up some 1942. Pick up whatever drinks you want. Ooh, big baller. Your lovely lady would like. So as his excuse to exit the scene, Gabriel has offered to go grab some drinks as Jordan stays behind with Vanessa to teach her how to play poker. And boom, Gabriel has made up his excuse to leave, which means that he's going to be joining me. Why would you leave your girl with, the, with your rich friend and you think she chose you already, man? I mean, I guess that's the whole point of the video, but I mean, I'm just... Pretty I'm just talking. Would it be bad if I asked him to get like some trash bags and some dish soap? No, <laughs> Ooh, I love that test I'm about to send him a whole grocery list. How are you doing? How are you doing? How is everything? He looks kind of short. Nice. Let me just mic you up really quick. There's nothing wrong with short dudes. I'm just saying he looks kind of short. Well, you can come a little closer if you like. So we'll start with, we'll just start with the chips. She didn't even hesitate. She moved right over. Bro, I've never been in a car that with the doors open like that. <laughs> like, this is my first time inside a car like that. Wow, <laughs> and he liked it. This is a wow. <laughs> The way we'll usually play is the black is 500, the blue is 350, green 175, red 100, and white is like 50. But for us, we'll have it a little bit less right now. So Jordan begins teaching Vanessa how to play some poker. This is all in an effort to break the ice now that they are finally alone. I really feel like I'm from somewhere. Jordan will begin making his move by bringing up the Tinder message that we photoshopped. Huh. Maybe was it, have you been to like any of my art shows or, I can't think of where it is, like maybe a concert? Oh, now I'm curious. I know you from somewhere. I know you from somewhere. Oh my God. I wonder if it's real. Like if it's if it's if it's fake, that's some good acting. Okay, so right here, Jordan is about to 
sees a Tinder screenshot that we photoshopped yeah. to see if she's like still using Tinder. Yeah. Sorry, you're...
sounds like Vanessa is perfectly okay with throwing away her relationship with Gabriel without even second guessing it. Jordan straight up asked her if she felt bad just dumping Gabriel like that, and her response was very cold. You should have just messaged me back. Like that's, I'm it's, I think it's your fault. Because maybe it was meant to be, you know? Like, you could have. This is like a stabbing heart to this one, bro. Just shoot me up to this one, man. Yeah, just shoot yourself. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't want to come I feel bad for bro. Oh my god, dude. No, like, I feel bad. I don't think you should feel bad. I'm like, I don't know. Vanessa could be acting this cold because there's a chance that she was probably already thinking about breaking up with Gabriel. Now that's fair, and she has every right to do so. But if those were her intentions all along, why didn't she break up with him sooner? Why did she feel the need to string him along until she found someone better? I really think I see a future with you. If we go on a date, you're going to have to delete Tinder. Like, you know, you can't be with anyone else. And you can't, like, because you got options and I got options. But you can't be exploring your options. So like, will you delete your Tinder? Like for you? Yes. Oh no! <laughs> Are you laughing? <laughs> she. He bros over there heartbroken and bros over there laughing in his face. I wanna die in one of these. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. You laughing right in bro's face. Tinder for him. I just find that so crazy because, like, she can't delete it for you. Now, this right here was just crazy. Vanessa was with. <laughs> you ain't have to point it out. You ain't have to spell it out like that, dude. Like, he know. You ain't got to repeat it. Like, he's sitting right there. Oh, my God. Delete Tinder for someone who she barely met today. She was not willing to delete it for someone who she's been in a relationship with. So, today. Today. So, alright, let me, let's play one more, let's do, let's do one more again. Maybe scoot back over there, like, you know, are you, are you good? Take a minute, man, take a minute. Take two. Sure, dude, hit or stay. I really tried, dude, you know, like. Nah, I feel it, man, yeah. yeah. The problem isn't you, dude. The problem is not you. I would even go as far as to say that the problem isn't even Vanessa. Again, it's not a bad thing for her to want to better herself and want more. The problem, though, is that she failed to communicate her wants with Gabriel and strung him along until she found someone better. I'm done, dude. I feel it. So. I'm done, bro. You want it? I want to go talk to her. You want to walk in there and get right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Do you need a minute? No. Not anymore, dude. Not anymore. <laughs> Not anymore, dude. I hate it. <laughs> and with that, Gabriel decides to have a conversation with Vanessa. We so when we walk in there, yeah, you can feel free to say to her whatever you want to say to her. I can help you explain something that you want me to help you explain something. Yeah, we don't need any help from you, dude. You're you suck. We don't want any help from you. You're a bad person too. Yeah, I'll let you shut up. So this entire thing was basically on just a test. 
So Gabriel just wanted to find out if he would be willing to trade in for Jordan. And so this entire conversation that you've been having with Jordan, Gabriel has been listening to it. He watched it live. And yeah. Now you have nothing.